Chives! Chimes, my suit doesn't fit me right. Can you fix it? Sir, I asked you to try it on three weeks ago. But no, you insisted on making a life-size sculpture of Devil's Tower out of mashed potatoes. Well, that meant something. Oh. It was important. Well, now you're going to have to wear it like that. But I can't co-host the Oscars looking like this. What if Dame Judy Dench is there? Oh, you know, I had a feeling this would happen. I think I have something that will fit you perfectly. Really? Yes, in fact, you look fantastic. Debonair! By your definition, you may even say you look sophisticated. Oh, I love sophisticated! Wait a minute. You look fantastic. You look debonair. You look sophisticated. Sir, you and I have very different definitions of the word sophisticated. Hm. Uh oh. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the stage the hosts of this year's Oscar Awards, Lord Felton Harcourt Osgood from it the third, and Jim's. It's Chimes! Oh. Thank you, thank you everyone, and thank you. Welcome to the show. It is an honor to be here hosting the Oscars. And Chives, may I say, you look dashing. Oh, yes you may. And may I say that you look like a very expensive... No, you may not. Why? Now, you know, when the Academy approached Chives and I about hosting the awards here, we humbly accepted. Yeah, we told them we couldn't have been more honored and privileged. Yes, honored, privileged, and pressed for time. Because the attention span of today's audiences don't exist anymore. I'm sorry, what? No, oh, nothing. Oh, all right. So in the interest of time, we're just going to skip all of the nominations and the voting and the speeches and the commercial breaks, and we're just going to go straight to the winners. First of all, I would like to thank the Academy. Chives, that isn't yours. What? You didn't win. You don't know that. Yes, I do. Oh, fine. So it is with continuing honor and privilege that we announce the winners of this year's Oscars and their representative categories. And the winners are... Best Original Playwright of a Play for Theatre which produces plays, Oscar Wilde. Best Original Songwriter of Songs for Music Sang in Musicals with Songs, Oscar Hammerstein II. Best Jazz Musician in a Jazz Band that Plays Jazz Music for Jazz Fans, Oscar Peterson. Best Dressed Man who is even better at dressing women, Oscar de la Renta. Best Man wearing oversized mittens while dancing like a butterfly and stinging like a bee, Oscar de la Hoya. Best accountant for a fake paper company on TV or film, but really only TV. Oscar Nunes. Best double amputee sprinter with a prison sentence, Oscar Pistorius. Best man to live with an annoying roommate with OCD in a very small apartment, Oscar Madison. Best baloney with a first name, Oscar Meyer. Best monster who lives in a trash can and talks to a worm, Oscar the Grouch. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen, this year's Oscar winners. And what a wonderful year for Oscars everywhere. Mm -hmm. But it doesn't end here. We still have one more category to announce, the Lifetime Achievement Award! And this is where you, the audience, come into play. That's right, Chives. We're going to be taking an online poll to find out who is the ultimate Oscar. Yep. And we'll announce the winner this Sunday, February 22nd at 8pm Central Standard Time during the airing of the... Well, the less interesting Oscars. So click on the link at the end of this video to cast your vote. And please note, you can find the link to the poll in the description of the video on YouTube. Mm -hmm. And as long as we've got your attention, don't forget to like The Ridiculous Puppet Company on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, yep. and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Yeah. And as always, I've been Lord Felton Harcourt Osgood from the third. Yep. This has been Chives. Yep. You've been the audience. I've been Terrific. Yep. Bob's your uncle and piss off. Woo! See you next week. Alright, time for some birthdays. This is for the week of February 22nd through the 28th. Happy birthday to Daniel McDermott. Happy birthday to Justin Link. Ooh la la. Happy birthday to Ben Kent. Happy birthday to Tammy Hollingsworth. Happy birthday to Angie Pelovi. Happy birthday to Kelsey McChesney. Happy birthday to the lovely Heather of Scoundrels Keep. Happy birthday to Colin Dunn, and happy birthday to Peter Kruger. <laughs> happy birthday to everybody.
And since we have some extra time, I would like to go ahead and thank the Academy for giving me... What? I think what? you're done. What the? I think, I think, I think I'm playing the music! No, 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 Why won't they play the music? No, no.